Yes, a very good morning once again. We are now going to be talking about music and another, another very interesting issue that is Roast and Rhyme that is going to be happening this Sunday. I have Jayla Birunji in studio. She's going to be letting us know what is going to be happening on that Sunday during the Roast and Rhyme event. A very good morning, Mr. Jayla, Mrs. Jayla Birunji. Mr. Jayla. Oh, no, 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 I wouldn't do that. <laughs> so how do you do? I'm okay, how Good are morning. you? Good morning. Good morning. How's Swans Avenue? Swans is very fine, very, mm -hmm. very fine. Yesterday we had um, mm -hmm. a massive event at work. We just released uh, Azawi's EP, our new signing from mm -hmm. Rust and Rye. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, you know why I had almost called you a mister? It's because yeah. of that cape. You, you, ha you have to get rid of it. You no, have... I can't. No, we just <laughs> want to see that beautiful face. You can see it now? No, not really, not really. Okay, it can, can go... I do that? It can go completely. <laughs> 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 Ladies and gentlemen, Jella Belongi from uh, Swangs Swans Avenue. Avenue. She's also actually uh, in the lead for the for the organizing committee that is actually putting this uh, event together on Sunday, the Ross and Rhyme event. It's the 12th edition. In Within four years, they hold three events of Ross and Rhyme every year. So you might be wondering, 12th edition, only four years. Yes, three every every year so she's going to be explaining to us the history of that and how we came to um, be celebrating roast and rhyme so yes. a very good morning once again okay. and uh, yeah tell us about that history of roast and rhyme history of 12th roast and edition rhyme. 12th edition. Tell, tell us about the very, very very first one the very first one okay uh one time we were at office mm -hmm. and uh because we love to eat so much if you realize each time i come here i come with a rosania of meat Where is just it? that this time it's it's morning and it's been raining so yes, it's okay yeah <laughs> so uh we usually do what we call lusania at mm, work mm -hmm. so one time both of our bosses julius and uh, benon were like how about we create something where families can just sit and you know enjoy, enjoy mm -hmm. meet mm -hmm. and uh sing because we usually sing while eating at mm -hmm. swings mm -hmm. most of the times we're singing and dancing mm -hmm. So we were like, okay, let's create an event that works with Ugandans, authentically mm. Ugandan, just live bands, a picnic family kind of thing because we need kids to be a part of it. Mm -hmm. And uh, we created Rust and Rhyme mm -hmm. that happens at Jahazi Pier Manyani. That, that was the beginning of Rust and Rhyme. Uh, how hard was the execution? Um, it wasn't hard. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't say it was hard because we have creative minds at Rust and mm -hmm. Rhyme. So everyone chipped in. And it was a collective effort to create it. It wasn't hard. Mm -hmm. Challenges, yes, here and there. Mm -hmm. When you're starting, uh, partnerships are not easy because uh, most brands don't think an event will work. Mm -hmm. But after the first event, actually, mm -hmm. that's when most of the partners started jumping on board because it, the, it was speaking to their brand. Mm -hmm. And uh, four years later, we're still here. And uh, what made it a success? Um, I'd say teamwork, mm -hmm. first of all, because Swangs, we have a good team. Mm. Everyone wants to help and everyone wants to work and everyone wants to create. Mm -hmm. So I'd say teamwork. Mm -hmm. And then also maybe um, we have a great fan base. Mm -hmm. Like uh, Ugandans really love Swangs Avenue. Mm -hmm. Everything we introduce to them, they come on board easily. Mm -hmm. And uh, also most brands um, associate with us. Mm -hmm. So I'd say that was... Uh, majorly part of the success. Mm -hmm. So yes. what should the viewer anticipate this coming Sunday this on Roast and Rhyme? I'm a first time on myself. I've never been to Roast and Rhyme. I'm hot. So <laughs> it is, this, this would be my very, very, very first inter okay. uh, interaction with you guys. Uh, so what, what should, should we expect? Expect uh, Roast and Rhyme this coming Sunday. Our edition is called the Reggae Raga Nyam Nyam. Mm -hmm. Yes. You're speaking to me. Go ahead. <laughs> Reggae Raga Nyam Nyam. So this one happens uh, we mostly are drawn to on in the production bit mm -hmm. we are mostly drawn to artists that are in the genre of reggae mm -hmm. raga mm -hmm. and dance hall mm -hmm. should yeah. we expect some chronics sizzler maybe some damian mali but you see they are international <laughs> acts this is purely ugandan <laughs> that's how you want to do it they <laughs> yes. could come and guide our very own reggae artists purely ugandan mm. we have had enough international acts mm -hmm. come in rust and rhyme shall and will purely be Ugandan. Okay, let's talk about that lineup. Mm. Who's, who's going to um, be performing? We have Apus. Mm -hmm. We have, uh, on, that is for the dancehall beat. Mm -hmm. On the raga beat, we have uh, John Black. Then on the reggae roots, we have uh, Rusby and Brothers. Mm -hmm. And then we have um, Janzi Band as our in-house band this mm -hmm. time. Usually, because you're a first-timer, you don't know mm -hmm. this, but usually mm -hmm. we have um, surprise acts. So we usually have one. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's a legend, sometimes, you know, it's a surprise. Mm -hmm. This time we have two. 
So wh why isn't this surprise act a local artist? I mean. It's a local artist. Amen. Amen. I thought you were bringing artists. someone who is international. No, so no, I no, like no, that. No, no. So you're celebrating local artists yes. with some yum yum in the process yes. and some reggae music. But yes. let's talk about reggae music as a whole. Yes. Why has it been so slow to take over in Uganda? It's a cultural kind of music, but mm. in Uganda it's been so, uh, uh, the penetration has been so slow. Why? Reggae music, I don't think reggae music is slow. I love reggae, but not so many people actually adhere to the values of reggae it's and the whole rhythm. It's actually funny. Mm -hmm. People that love reggae don't actually say that they love reggae. Mm -hmm. Reggae is ourselves. music for the soul. Mm -hmm. So you listen to reggae at home. It's, mm -hmm. it's not taking slow. Mm -hmm. It's just that we don't have a lot of dancehall reggae artists. Mm -hmm. But it's not slow. So what can we do right in, in this interim to ensure that we grow the industry mm -hmm. and multiply the number of reggae artists in Uganda? Rust and Rye. Apart from Rust and Rye? Well, we, uh, I, I don't know much, but I think mm -hmm. if, if uh, an artist really likes reggae and mm -hmm. they know how to sing it, mm -hmm. and they, it's, you just have to just love it mm -hmm. and do what you love. Mm -hmm. Eventually, mm -hmm. it will pay off. That's mm -hmm. all you can say. Love what you do, mm -hmm. sing the reggae that you know, mm -hmm. eventually it will pay off. Don't look at the money at the no, beginning. It should if be. You, if you start looking at money when you're working, when you're working with passion, mm -hmm. it never works out. Okay, let's talk about the tickets. How much are they going for? Tickets right now are at 50,000 shillings. Mm -hmm. um, Ali Bad is still running. Mm -hmm. It's going to end tomorrow mm -hmm. or today in the night because we're running out of tickets. Mm -hmm. So it's at 50,000 shillings right now. Mm -hmm. But at the gate, they'll be at 70,000 mm -hmm. shillings. Yes. Mm -hmm. What's your take on the, um, on the level of, uh, of new music in Uganda for the upcoming artists um, on a scale of 1 to 10? I'd say 8. You'd say 8? Yes. These kids are very creative. Mm -hmm. They're too creative. They are too creative. If you realize... Most of the bars these days mm -hmm. play Ugandan music. Mm -hmm. Like you'll have at least four hours of Ugandan music. So it's, it's working for us. Right about now, I mm -hmm. think Jayla is going to do us the honors and maybe eh. shake a little bit for okay. us. What do you think as we <laughs> actually head into this break? Thank you very much for having made the time to come. Okay. Mr. DJ Zoe B, please, a song for Jayla to show us a little bit of what we should anticipate on Sunday. Show us that vibe. Uh -huh. Let's do this. Stand up a little bit. Okay. <laughs> Let's play some music right oh there. Oh, dear. Why me? <laughs> <laughs> I am an Let's, did you, let's do this.